Hello, my name's Robert Dean Steele, and today we're reading and praying through the Psalms. Now, this happens to be a Psalm of the Ascents, which basically means that as the pilgrims were heading into Jerusalem from the north, south, east, and west, depending on which direction they would be coming, they would be coming in and looking at the hill country of Judea, which Jerusalem is part of. And as they were traveling, let's say, for example, from east to west, let's say from Jericho over to Jerusalem. You have Jericho at 900 feet below sea level in the uh, event of 11 miles. You go up to 2,500 feet above sea level. That means in that 11 miles, you are climbing up about 3,400 feet. So as they come over the hill, let's say the Mount of Olives, they see the beautiful temple in front of them, and this is what they say. I live my eyes under the hill. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, who's the maker of heaven and earth. So they're looking at the hill country. They're looking at the temple and they say, you know, there's this beautiful structure and it is a symbol of who the Lord is. And my help comes from the Lord. He's the maker of all heaven and earth. He will not let your foot slip. He who watches over you will not slumber. He will not sleep. Indeed, he watches over Israel, and he doesn't slumber, and he doesn't sleep. So he's watching not only over the individual, but he's also watching over the nation as well. The Lord watches over you. The Lord is your sh shade at your right hand. Isn't that great to know that you have some shade and cover as well on your right hand, which is your hand of strength then he goes on to say the lord the sun will not harm you by day nor the moon by night so doesn't matter any time of the day you will be protected the lord will keep you from all harm he will watch over your life you have a hedge of protection around you from the beginning of your life to the end of your life the lord will watch over your coming and your going so if you're going into jerusalem the Lord will watch you. The Lord is, you're going out of Jerusalem, either way, or any place you find yourself, literally, the Lord is going to be watching over you, both now and forevermore. That's the consistency and the constancy of the Lord. Psalm 121. We've been praying and we've been reading over it. My name is Robert D. Steele.